Here are some common calculator actions. First, if we want to clear out the history, we could go to Control, Menu, 1, Clear History. And there it goes. To clear it out for the graph, you press Control, Menu, 5, and then Enter. Now, if you want to convert a fraction to a decimal, you would click on Menu, Number, Convert to Decimal, and then Enter. If you want to convert it from Decimal to Fraction, you would click Menu, Number, Approximate to Fraction. Enter. Now let's just say that we want to solve for a system of equations. To do that, we first type in R, R, E, F for reduced row echelon form. Put parentheses, and then to create your matrix, you go to menu, matrix and vector, go to create matrix so you're going to put in your number of rows let's put in two number of columns three okay and then you would type in just the coefficients for each of the terms in our equations so let's just say we had 2x plus 5y equaled 1 for our first equation our second equation, let's say that we had 8x plus 4y equals 2. Now to find the answer to this system, you just press enter. And the two numbers on the last column are our solutions. 3 sixteenths is our x value. 1 eighth is our y value. Okay, now let's talk about how to graph something. You go to Menu, Graph Entry Edit, and then Function. Let's type in X to the second power. And then plus 5, no, minus 5. And then Enter. Okay, there's various buttons that you could use. So we have our nth root button and our square root button ln natural log our log and then we also have our caret button which is used to put exponents in. If you delete out the equal sign a lot of times these inequalities will show up if they don't, if they do not show up, you could instead go to Menu, Graph Entry Edit, you're going to go to Relation. This is also useful if you have something that's not in the Y equals form. Let's just say we had 3x plus Y is greater than one. To get our other inequality symbols, you just press control then the equal sign. Go ahead, enter. It shades it in for you and everything here. So let's go ahead and clear this out. So now we're going to go over how to analyze stuff. So let's go ahead and type in an equation. So first, here how this is how you zoom in and out. So you go to menu, window zoom, can zoom in, you can zoom out, and then if you want to reset it, you just go to zoom standard, and then if it's still not showing up for you, you can always go zoom fit. 
to find zeros, for example, you go to analyze graph and then zero. Zero is when it touches the x axis. So go ahead and scroll on both sides of that zero and then it will give you that coordinate point. For the other zero, you do the same thing. Left side, right side, enter. Now if you want to analyze the graph for your minimum, you would just go to the left and right sides of that minimum. And if you wanted to find a maximum, which there is none there, you would do the same thing. Okay, now to find the intersection, you go to Menu, Analyze Graph, Intersection. Left and right, Enter, and it will give you that coordinate point. You might want to clear some of these out because it will be hard to see. To go to your table, you just press Control T, and it will give you each X value on the small little column and that will give you your output values your y values for each of your equations if you want to get out of the table you press Control t again okay the last thing we'll go over is how to do linear regressions so you go to new document add list of spreadsheets Let's call this one X and this one Y. So we'll just put some random values in. And then to find our regression, we go to menu, statistics, stat calculations, linear regression MX plus B. Your X list, you're just going to choose your first column X. Y list, you choose Y. Press OK. It will give you your linear regression formula. You have the MX plus B form, where M is approximately 12.4 and B is 11.2. The R squared represents how how similar it actually is and how accurate it is with the data that you put in. This could be used to predict stuff there are certain questions.